Hello everyone, so I'm about to blab on about this book called It's Kind of a Funny Story by Ned Vizzini. So I picked it up with pretty high expectations because I heard really good things about it and I just heard it was very uplifting. So I started reading it and it's about this boy named Craig who is 15 and he is depressed. So the first third of the book is reasons why he's depressed and just like what he's going through and how he's really suicidal and I was reading it and I was like really questioning why I was reading this book because it was so sad and it was just making me depressed reading it so he then gets to the point where he's like okay tomorrow I'm gonna kill myself like I'm gonna jump over the Brooklyn Bridge and I'm gonna kill myself which is no spoiler it's on the back of the book so calm down and he decides to not do that and he calls the suicide hotline and he then goes to a mental hospital so that's the first third of the book and then things started picking up in the hospital and it started getting better so I was glad that I stuck with it so basically he just meets a bunch of different people in the mental hospital and he learned so much life lesson so much life lesson so many life lessons and it is actually one of my favorite books and I recommend it if you're a teenager if you are in high school if you are sad you should read this book because we can all relate to Craig and he the author just makes him so believable and like the author does not hold back anything he tells you straight up what's going on and what teenage boys go through and he like really just lays it out there for you to read and then I read on about him the author and so he spent like a couple days like five or six days in a mental hospital before he wrote this book that was a really good idea because you could tell like he really knew what he was talking about and he painted like a great picture for you to imagine the characters and the setting and everything so Props to the author, I loved him, and he just made Craig a really good character. That's pretty much all I wanted to say. Basically, by the end of it, you are smiling. Literally the last 20 pages, I was like smiling, and it was probably really creepy, because I was just like, because it just made me so happy at the end, and so I'm so glad that I stuck with it and I read the whole thing, because literally you zoom through it, and it's not one of, it has like deep meanings. But it's not one of those books where you have to like really think about the meaning. It's just kind of there like laying on the page for you to read. So you can literally like zoom through this book really fast. And it has really small, I mean not small, big text. So that's good. And yeah, it just teaches you that like literally you just need to be happy and get rid of things in your life that don't make you happy. And I think we all need to be reminded of that sometimes. And just like slow it down and just enjoy life and I think it's awesome and I love this book and I really recommend it for everyone because we all get sad sometimes and it's just like a good reminder that like it's okay and it will get better and it's just high school and it doesn't matter and the moment that the cover clicks for you it's really awesome because then you're like oh and you can like let me show you because for the different parts he has like a weird um shape and I was like, what? And then I realized like it corresponds to a shape on the cover, which is so awesome. And I thought that was really cool. Because it starts out with where he is at the X. And then it like moves around shapes on the cover. And it's so cool. Um, and it's just like a well-made book. It feels nice. And I love it. And I highly recommend it. And that's all I have to say about it. So please pick it up. It's really good. And no wonder everyone loves it. Because it is very uplifting and nice to read. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video, and have a great day. Bye, guys.